Rise, Gonzalez. The time has come for you to awaken. You are fated to have a hand in a great destiny, and it will soon find you. The time has come for you to awaken. Gonzalez. Hey sleepyhead, I know how much you like to sleep in, so I'm guessing this letter will be all alarm clock this morning. Did I guess right? Rise and shine, Gonzalez. Today's today is the wing ceremony. You promise you promised me to meet me before it starts, remember? You'd better not be keeping keep me waiting, Zelda. Okay, so how's it going here, got uh, Steve, and today we're gonna play some Skyward Sword And uh, we're gonna keep on going with the playthrough and this stuff I uh, hope you're gonna like it, so we're gonna start off right off the bat And I already read the controls And yeah Let's do this shit Okay uh, I'm gonna open this First door opened, hashtag Fap and here, here we got a guy dressed like- Hey, he is dressed like me. <laughs> Morning, was Wazalas. Yeah, so today is the wing ceremony. Are you ready? All I'm saying is everyone else is out, uh, out practicing at the plaza, but you seem pretty relaxed about the whole thing. Of course, the, that crimson loftwing of yours is something special. I feel pretty confident writing him. <laughs> I'd feel pretty confident writing him too. Uh, my bird won the my bird won the last ceremony, but uh, even I don't think he could beat that red terror of yours. Of course, a bird's true speed in a race always comes down from to the skill of the rider. Uh, I'm something of the bird researcher uh, around here, so in, so you know if you ever find some uh, find yourself in need of some bird expertise, some come see old Pippin. These are some rooms. I'm not gonna. What, what is it? Clean, cleanliness is next to nightliness. Keep your sleeping quarters tidy, tidy, <laughs> tidy, tidy. Some, yeah. Okay, so there, there, there's this guy humping this barrel. That is art right there. Just let me coach ya, show you about my culture. It's a late night show like Kona. This party ain't over. Good morning, Gonzalez. Today is the big wing ceremony, right? I wanted to fly too, but I, I didn't make the cut, so I'm stuck back here, back here at the academy. Maybe it's because you're constantly humping barrels. I, I think your biggest uh, problem is that. I'm very sorry, sir, but you never... And with your green hair, like, oh my god. Okay, can I help you? Like, yeah, I'm gonna pick up. There you go. Oh, thanks. I didn't think you had time to help me out, because I'm busy. Sorry, sorry, dude. All oh, right, you got today's wing ceremony. You, you to think about. You can leave that there. Okay, I'm actually not gonna explore shit. I'm just gonna go on with the storyline. I'm gonna maybe I'm gonna start with the um, side quest when I actually get the Skyward Sword or what's it called? Yeah, I've heard that it's called the Sword of Goddess something. Yeah. Oh well, Skyloft. Okay, so this is our save points. Yeah, so I'm gonna quickly save. Save. How obvious. Hey, hey Gonzalez, up here, up here. <laughs> Why did I repeat that line? Nope. Good morning to you, Gonzalez. Today's finally the day of the long awaited wing ceremony. Are you feeling ready? Oh, I just remembered. There's something I'd like to ask you about. Uh, look this way while pressing and holding Z. Then press A to have a quick chat with me. I hope it's quick, because I don't have time for some weird dudes. Excellent. Always remember you can press Z to target something. Uh, once you have targeted something with Z, you can easily talk to him or her by pressing A. And even when there isn't anything to target, press Z 
is a con convenient way to quickly face your view forward. Oh, but it's a little silly to carry on a conversation from this distance. Why didn't you come? Why why don't you come join me up here? Sure, fam. Uh, you should be able to climb up uh, if you dash up to the top of the wooden box, don't you think? Move while holding A to dash. You should be able to make that jump fairly easy. Try com climbing, blah, climbing up here. Yeah. Sure. Okay. So what do you think? Using A to dash is useful, isn't it? Yes. Hello. Don't dash around uh, so much that you. Uh, tire yourself out, or uh, your stamina gauge will empty, and you'll be, and you'll be completely out of breath. It's best to take a little break when your stamina gauge gets close to empty. Got all that? On to the next point. You can jump a short distance like this just by moving toward it. It's like it's something I like to call the auto jump. Ah, yes, auto jump. It just has a nice ring to it. How amazing! Okay, uh, well, I'm dashing. I think it's the first time you will ever actually be, to be able to sprint in a Zelda game. So are you up to rushing to get some last minute bird riding practice in the morning, Gonzalez? Uh, oh, you have someone to meet. Ah, Zelda waiting. Uh, Zelda's waiting for you, is she? Of course, she's my bitch. Perfect timing then. You see, Zelda's father, Headmaster Gaypora, has a pet named Mia, and well, she's scampered off again. Look. Over there, do you see her? The headmaster is so busy working with Zelda preparing for the ceremony. I thought that maybe I should be, uh, I, sh I should feed her. But the ceremony is about to start and I just put on a fresh set of clothes and well, you see. Will you help me out and go retrieve Mia for me? Yes, of course I will. Fantastic, so you'll do it. I know you're, you're in a hurry, so I really appreciate your taking the time to help me. Why not, weird panda guy? You should be able to climb up somewhere over there. If you hang off the ledge there, you can cl climb onto the roof from the other side. I'm terribly sorry, but I know you're quite the cl uh, but I know you're quite the climber. I really do appreciate it. Sure, fam. There we go. Leap, 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 bitch, leap. I said. Okay, jump, senpai. Hey, Gonzalez. I don't care how good a jumper you think you are. You're never gonna. You never reach a roof that high just by pressing A to dash. There should be a wooden box up there. Grab and move one with A and use it as a platform of sorts. You can climb onto a, a, a platform by pressing A to, uh, to dash or by pressing the control stick forward for a few moments. Yeah. Okay, nice. That takes a lot of stamina, man. But whatever. How you doing, Mia? That's that's actually a quite cute cat. Look at it. It's so cute. Look like Simba. Here we go. Huh. Ow. Oh! <laughs> I can throw her. She is Simba. Okay, I bring the cat. Nice work. You bought her back safe and sound. Sorry for troubling you with this. I know you're busy, Gonzalez. I suppose you should uh, feed Mia now. Please tell the headmaster that I found his his pet. He should be uh, up by the statue of the, uh, of goddess. I believe Zelda is there with him, so you should hurry along. Okay, good to know. Let's go get some business. I feel like this is gonna be a really long cutscene. Something is telling me that this cutscene is gonna be really long, but... I don't know. I'm not gonna skip it because I want to know the story exactly. Oh, yes! Guided by the servant of the goddess. Unite earth and sky. Bring light to the land. Yep. Beautiful sign right there. Hey, good morning, Gonzalez. I'm glad to see my loft ring got you out of bed. It spitted, it spitted your letter on my face. Uh, not that nice. Uh, I was uh, pretty sure you'd sleep in and forget to meet me this morning. <laughs> Look at Link, uh, Gonzalez. He's like so stunned. He like, he's like not moving. 
Feels a little bit awkward. No, there we go. But look at this instrument and look at its outfit. Uh, they, they are mine to use today in the ceremony since I'll be playing the role of the goddess. Aren't they beautiful? Especially this instrument. They they tell uh, they tell me it's just like one of the uh, one the goddess was said to have in the legends. It sounds gorgeous too. I ask father about it and he says it's called a harp. Uh, and look at these clothes. I made this wrap myself and and we get to use it in today's ceremony. Between the harp and this uh, and this uh, outfit, I'm going to make a great goddess today. I got you up early this morning because I wanted you to be the first to see me like this, Gonzalez. Oh, that's so cute. So cute. So how do I look? Uh, <laughs> there's actually an alternative saying, uh, I'm gonna go with that one. <laughs> it was the best one. Really? You know, maybe it does look a little weird. <laughs> I just said, uh, I didn't say it looked bad on you. Look, he's so happy. He's like, oh yeah, I can't do it. <laughs> Sorry, I'm tired. Uh, ah, there you are, Zelda. Are you all prepared for the today's ceremony? Oh, hello, father. She's like so disappointed. Ah, Gonzalez, you're here too. Outstanding. It's uh, encouraging to see you up so early, giving you giving your capacity for sleep. No doubt today's ceremony had you too excited to close your eyes for once. No, I actually slept quite good and I dream dreamed of a quite weird monster. If you win today's ceremonial race, you'll get the, you get to participate in the post race post race ritual with Zelda. So give it your best out there. Yes, about that. Well, father, I don't know if he can make, if he can do it. That's so mean. He's like so offended. Recently, Gonzalez hasn't been practicing much at all for the ceremony. And even when he's out riding, he's lofting, he's just lazy gli glide gliding around, probably daydreaming. Thinking about boobs. I don't know uh, what he's thinking, he's going to have to be in perfect control of his bird to win today. No need to worry yourself, Zelda. Uh, thought you may have a point, today's wing ceremony tests the skills of the rider as well as the bond to his bird. Victory will not come easily. And as you pointed out, I haven't seen him pra practicing as hard as some of the other students. But you, uh, but you have uh, known him uh, since you were both uh, both really little. You should uh, know better than to fret about him. You see, Gonzalez and his laughing share a special connection. I've never seen anything quite like it. As you know, each of us in Skylof is uh, but one half of, uh, of a pair. We are only made uh, whole by our loft wings, the guardian birds that the goddess bestows uh, upon each of us as a symbol of a divine protection. When you are young, every one of us meets our loft wing under the great statue of the goddess. Well, you are pretty fat! So I know your loft wing would be very exhausted if it carried you, I'm just saying. Uh, Loughing on the great statue of the goddess. It's quite a big moment, as I'm sure you recall. Uh, but the first meeting between Gonzalez and his Loughing was extraordinary. The bird that came to him was a crimson Loughing. It is a breed so rare we were sure for some time that uh, it had vanished from the line. Yes, and the boy and his bird seemed to share a profound connection from the moment they met. Do you recall seeing Gonzalez and that loft, uh, loft wing of his when they first met? What a sight. The little boy just hopped on, uh, hop up on that bird and gracefully flew away without even a moment of instruction. They were meant for each other. And judging by how jealous you were that day, I'd say the friendship he shared with this bird didn't go unnoticed by you, my dear. So, so she wanted that bird. Good to know. Oh, what's that? Ah, uh, but who can who can blame you? The knight, of course. <laughs> I'm sure you weren't the only one uh, in infusing of the powerful bond shared uh, by Gonzalez and his bird. Anyone who is a who is a part of something special is bound to catch some nasty looks sooner or later. Hoo hoo. <sighs> <laughs> 
This contest is nothing to laugh at, father. The ceremony is part of the final test of those training, uh, those training to become knights of Skyloft. If Gonzalez doesn't fly fast enough during the race, what if Gonzalez messes up his big chance? What if he's not allowed to become a knight? Calm down, my dear. It will be fine. Honestly, it's almost as uh, though you uh, become a completely different person uh, when you worry about Gonzalez. Listen, Gonzalez, you better fly your heart out there. At the very least, you need to squeeze in a little practice time before the race. Come on, you'll thank me later. Okay, so I'm gonna, I'm just gonna jump. Here we are, go on now, jump off the edge and call your loft wing. It's almost time for the ceremony, so try to practice seriously for once. Hmm? Oh yeah? You can't sense your bird out there. Well, I can't. Oh, I get it, you're trying to weasel out of having to practice. Nice try, but you're not fooling me. Off you go. What? She just pushed me. That's so mean. Okay, Gonzalez, go ahead and press down to call your loft wing. I pressed it. I can see his penis. Hmm. His bud sure is taking taking a long time to what? I didn't have to, something is wrong. <laughs> you stupid son of a bitch. Oh. Is my bud dead? Did it did it happen something to it? Hang in there, Gonzalez. I got you. Well, I have some kind of relation with my bird, so I should know, or I should be able to sense it out in the sky. Are you two all right? Yeah, I should be. I'm sorry, friend. I didn't mean to push you so hard. Uh, you didn't sprain your wing, did you? I thought she was talking about me. What a little bitch. Well, good good thing she's not a princess in this game. This is, this is very odd, Gonzalez. Who could have possibly hap what could have possibly happened to your loft wing? I don't know. For a bird to ignore the call of his master, it's unheard of. It's unheard of. And you still can't sense your bird nearby, eh, Gonzalez? No, I can't. It is quite a problem, especially considering the wing ceremony is about to start. Oh, God. Someone stole it? Gonzalez, when you said you couldn't sense your loft wing, well, I should have believed you. I'm sorry. Well, yeah, you could. <laughs> Uh, I need to tend uh, to my own loft wing, so I'll catch up with you later. Okay. You better go on ahead and uh, see if you can find where your bird has gone. Okay. Ooh. My, how did, did it get to be so late? If I recall correctly, this year Instructor Howell is pre proceeding over the ceremony. Gonzalez, you should go explain the situation to him and see if he's willing to delay the race a little so that you can find your bird. Should do. But father, you're the headmaster of the academy. If Gonzalez asks the instructor Holwell, he probably just can't talk to you about it. She's got a point, actually. Ah, quite true, as usual. You make an excellent point, my dear. <laughs> point, my dear. Very well, I explained the situation to him myself, Gonzalez. Run uh, along to tell instructor Holwell to come see me at... Uh, see my quarters. I guess it's a panda guy. Okay, let's run to him. I'm gonna sprint like Sanic. Let's do this. He's actually quite fast. I'm happy that you can sprint in this game. It's much easier. And the design of the game is quite nice. It's It looks like a painting. That's what I like about the game. Okay. So here we got little instruction hall. Well, how are you doing, sir? What's wrong, Gonzalez? You're looking a little pale. What? Uh, your loft wing is missing. How strange and troubling. Do you do you think you can find him? You're going to start looking for him now. How will you make it back in time to fly uh, in the ceremony? It looks like your participating your participation in the ceremony hing is uh, on feather or not. You can find the bird on time. Um, ex excuse me. I see. So the headmaster has summoned me. All right then. I go speak with him immediately. I still owe you for helping me out earlier, so don't worry about the ceremony for now. Uh, you focus on finding your loft wing. Okay. I'm gonna find that bit. Okay. 